All right. So next up is Apple TV. Am I correct? That was the next. Yep. And I have an intimate relationship with Apple TV. So you use it. I use it. Yeah. yeah. I have it on my main TV at home. And I have been somewhat critical of it in the past here on this channel, mm. uh, particularly around the way in which you interface with it. Yeah. I don't find voice to be as effective on, as on certain Google products. However, I like certain AirPlay aspects and mm -hmm. things about the Apple TV that have made it convenient on the main TV in my house. The other thing that's driving me, dr drove me absolute banana town in the past has been the remote, which I've, I mean, I probably covered it too many times here on the channel. They redid the remote! Yes. They redid it! Good on them. We knew they were going to do it. The rumor was they were going to do it. And they just got rid of that dumb, swipey, top portion, mm. nightmare fest, nightmare fuel. Ruined many a good time. You're just having a party. Somebody picks it up. They swipe. They tap. Party over. This was the old one? Inadvertent. No, no, no. This is the old one. That's the nightmare fuel. Yeah. And I love the simpli simplicity of it, the look of it, but it just didn't work like that. It just didn't work how it was supposed to. Like, or not how it was supposed to. I mean, it did have a touchpad on it. It just, I don't know. It never translated to the TV. The yeah, you touch said it was too input. small. Well, no, th that's, that's the secondary subject, but just the touchpad. Okay scrubbing along and trying to have precision with it and not trying to have unintended inputs. Now, I will say, you can figure it out as a person on Earth. But I got youngsters in my house. I got people in my house. Sure. And to watch everybody navigate the thing that isn't you and to see the lag factory as a consequence, mm. trying to find a certain spot on the timeline or pause it by tapping the thing on the exact spot without it just lodging ever so slightly every time to a different spot in the show will be such a frustrating experience. I'm ranting and raving. Yes. I'm foaming Let's at the mouth. The new. I'm foaming at the mouth over here, but I just, I mean, obviously I had to hit you with the recap. The new is way better. It's almost like an iPod style interface with a nice little wheel along the top. And... I already watch. It's a jog wheel. It is so genius. Are you going to just scroll forever here, Will? I think you could have just stopped earlier I'm up. I'm telling you. You're not going to get a full. There you go. Holy cow. The slowest scroll. That was a marathon scroll right there. It is a jog wheel. My God. I never knew how much I wanted a jog wheel. It's also a universal remote, or it acts like it. It turns on your TV as well, right? Yeah, the old one did that, too. Oh, it did? Yeah, the old one did that, too. Then why did they... Well, because that? they just want to remind you, Will. Oh. They just want to remind you. Okay. But now it's a jog wheel, so you scrub through what you're playing just by simply rolling around. And it reminds me of iPod in the olden days, because I'm right. 78 years old. Yes. And... There was not that it's, it's for certain things like moving through a timeline. There's really not many better ways to do it with your thumb than a jog wheel. They changed the color of it. It's aluminum now. They moved the microphone over to the side. Get a nice dedicated power switch up there. Play pause. Volume is on there. It's still very basic. You're still going to lose it. I'm still going to have to put some case or wristband on it in my house. You people can probably deal with it. And how do you charge it? Does it? It's uh, it previously was lightning. I presume. Lightning? I presume it's the same. I don't know. Did they put a Type C? Press, press the tech specs, so we can be certain here. It got a little taller too, so it should be a little bit easier to hang on to. Yeah, five point four inches tall. Um, let's see. Bluetooth five point IR transmitter. That's for for a TV as well. Microphone, of course. Uh, USB to computer. Or power adapter sold separately. I'm going to presume it's still lightning. Hmm. USB-C would be nice. I'm going to presume it's still lightning.